knee grabs. This is a really great basic abdomen exercise. I'm gonna show you the full version first, and then I'm gonna break it down as to how you can modify this. If your abdomen strength isn't quite there yet, or your back bothers you, because there's always something that, as a coach, especially if you're a coach watching this, that we're always working with, right? There's never, very rarely is it just like perfect body mechanics and no injuries along the way. So, what does this move look like? You're gonna extend your legs all the way out, arms can come out, they can be across your chest, really it's whatever you wanna do, as long as you're not flinging your body weight up, we're in good position. You're going to pull your chest up and dig your heels down towards your butt cheeks here. So the goal is to not pull the knees into your chest and round through, but actually pull the heels in and grab your knees, keep that nice long spine. Inhale to extend nice and long. Exhale to pull back in, heels towards your butt cheeks. You'll notice that my neck stays pretty much in the same position the whole way through. I'm not dropping down my head. I'm not fully resting every time, but I'm maintaining that hollow hold in the bottom, and that's going to be the goal. However, not always, not always not an option. So if you need to rest, just let them rest. If it does not work for you in this position, so first off, I want to talk about why the heels to the bum rather than knees to the chest. If people are complaining about hip flexors or um, yeah, their hips primarily, the hip flexors are cramping on them or popping, it's typically because they're pulling through the hip flexors versus digging the heels down and really pulling through the abdomen. So something to be mindful of is if people's hips hurt, you're probably pulling through the knees into your chest. Now, what do you do to modify this? Super simple, hands come behind you and only go as far as your body lets you go before you start to experience discomfort. So for people with back injuries, that might be here, right? They might stop here and pull back in or maybe they do one leg at a time and they come all in, extend, other leg comes in. Break it down, make it simple, make it a little less complicated, but that is the knee grab and all of its modifications. Enjoy.